It is. I'm going to dance. Okay, we are live on Facebook. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the very first Ho Fluentella show. So before we start, let me quickly explain what is going to happen. So the Faux Fluentella show is a live game show streamed right here on Facebook, and we will have a lot of fun learning about other languages. So this week we will be doing an uh, Afrikaans, and hopefully we will have some more languages in the future. Um, the basic concept of the game is that one contestant, uh, which is Daniel today, will have to guess the literal translations of a word in a language he is not familiar with at all. So the rules of the game is super simple. There are 10 words that Daniel will have to guess the translation of. So he will, ha however, have some help uh, in the form of three lifelines. So the first one is Ask the Audience, which today is the lovely Nana and Brick. They will be helping him, I hope. Um, and then the second lifeline, Daniel, is a visual representation. So I will do my worst to draw a picture for you if you struggle. Um, and then the third is a general description of the word. So I will be asking Wikipedia to help you. Um, but the difficulty of the words will increase as we get closer to number 10. Okay, so before we do that, let's introduce ourselves. So my name is Marie. Um, I'm the head English and Afrikaans teacher here at Fluentella, and I'm also the host today. Um, and our first contestant is Daniel. Daniel, will you introduce yourself? Oh, of course. All right, my name is Daniel. I'm the head Portuguese teacher over here at Fluentella. I'm from Brazil. Lived abroad for quite some time, uh, almost 10 years. Oh my God, almost 10 years, but that was a long time ago. I was thinking about that the other day. It's been almost seven years. Oh, wow, I'm getting old. <laughs> so today okay, we're gonna... And, and, sorry, Daniel, I just wanna <laughs> be, sh be sure. Um, how much Afrikaans do you actually know? Oh, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so this is gonna be, this is An gonna be a lot of fun. expert in nothing of, <laughs> related to African. <laughs> okay, so for those of the, the people watching, what exactly is Afrikaans? Uh, so it's one of the national languages in South Africa, and it is a, considered a West Germanic language. So people who understand German, Dutch, Flemish, um, they will probably also be able to guess what the words are because these languages are very relatable, related, sorry. Um, now, Nana is also from South Africa, but she does not speak Afrikaans. So Daniel, maybe Nana can help you here, I hope. She might be your your saving grace today. I don't know. I so. don't know about Brick. Brick's just gonna like. I'm I'm the hidden weapon. <laughs> oh, I actually, oh, okay. I'm actually fluent. I'm fluent <laughs> in no Africa. No. Okay. I know awesome. nothing. <laughs> so this is Brick. He is one of the English teachers. He is from England, currently living in Bali. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. In Indonesia. Yeah. In Bali. Okay, and then this is Nana. She is our, she's an English teacher, but also the head is a Zulu teacher. And she is from Durban, South Africa, right? Yes, okay, awesome. Um, so they are here to help Daniel today or perhaps hinder him. I don't know, we will see. <laughs> Do you hear okay, that guys? So our, help our... me, you're here to help me. <laughs> our category today is food, one of my right. favorite things. Um, and we're going to be asking Daniel to guess the translation of these 10 Afrikaans food items. So, Daniel, Nana, and Brick, are you guys ready to begin? Let's go. Yes. Let's go. Okay, Let's so do that. here we go. No Googling. This is your Google. So, Daniel, <laughs> your, your first word, no, Brick. <laughs> your first word is the word jumping corn. Popcorn. <gasps> in English. Didn't even think about it. That's fantastic. It's popcorn. Okay, yes. So the first one is popcorn. So in Afrikaans, it is called spring milis. 
which literally translates to jumping corn. Well done, you got one point, Daniel. Okay, that was the easy one. Um, next up, number two, leaf salad. Think about leaf it first. Leaf salad. Think about it first, leaf salad. The you thing can is, use leaf, a you can use a lifeline. The, the thing is, leaf salad to me is already a type of food. So, like, <laughs> okay, <laughs> leaf but, but salad. Try and, try and guess the English word. Like lettuce. Well is done. Lettuce? Very good. Okay, so these are the easy ones. It's going to get harder now. <laughs> um, number three is the word chew glue. Oh, that's bubble gum. <laughs> <laughs> nice bubble gum, good. Wow, you were really good at this. This is getting, I thought this would be a lot harder. Okay, number four. This might be a, a hard one. All right. Uh, no, sausage bread. <laughs> that's one of the like sausage bread to me. <laughs> that's just bread. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sausage bread, which is, sausage all right, okay. Let me... Oh, I think Brick knows. I, do you want to ask the Yes, I want to ask. Okay, the audience, Greg, what do you think? I, I, I think it's a sausage roll. Mm, Nana, do you okay. have any ideas what a sausage bread could be? You know, like the pastry. Hot dog roll? Yeah, I'll think about like a, like a hot dog. <laughs> Nana! <laughs> I'll think about like a hot dog bun, but. It is! It's a it hot is? dog! Nice! Like a oh, hot dog nice. Bun. Good. So the Afrikaans for that would be uh, brueki, which literally means a sausage bread. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Breaky. Hot dog. Well done, Nana. Okay. You have three so far. Okay. 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 Number five, an ocean cat. Wait, ocean cat? Yes. Ocean cat. Mm. <laughs> Ocean cat. All right. Let me think. Now it gets a little one. more difficult. Ocean cat. So it's obviously something you can eat, which comes yeah. from the ocean. Um, I'll think of like maybe catfish. No. Wait. Is do we find catfish in the ocean, or is it a freshwater fish? That you asking the wrong person about this kind of stuff. And I'm I not a seafood Brick, guy. I think Brick is actually Googling while we are doing this. I can see your screen reflecting on your face. <laughs> <laughs> Ocean cat. All right. Ocean cat. I think of, I'm thinking of. Okay, just, just take a, uh, okay, it's not catfish. Take another guess. Ocean, all right. Oh my Mama, God. Do I think you have any ideas? <laughs> ocean cat. I would have Anna? said catfish as well. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, ocean okay, cat, all right, catfish. Stumped? There you go. That's it. <laughs> okay, so right. an ocean all right, fish. Drawing. Okay. Let's go for drawing. I, I think drawing. Okay, you want to, you want to. I want to use. Okay. Let's see. I want to see your skills, this, Mary. Is this Mary? Are, are you... skills coming out now? This is where yeah. I'm going to draw something for you. Yeah, um, it's just gonna. <laughs> so listen, I'm gonna do my worst. Honestly, oh, you're gonna, gonna do, do your my worst. worst? <laughs> I'm gonna. And I'm actually gonna close my eyes while I draw this. So. Oh, that's awesome! All right. Oh. Oh, is that? Wait, one, two, three, four, five, five. <laughs> I closed my eyes. All right. That's a pretty good effort. Is that a squid? Is that a squid or? It's not a squid. No, I, I think Nana know. knows what it is. Maybe. Yeah. It, it, it's a. Or is it jellyfish? It's, it's it not jellyfish? a jellyfish. No, no, no. It's not a jellyfish. What? Okay, I'm gonna put well, you out of your misery. It's not a squid. It's not it's, jellyfish. I'm put you out of your misery. Could be. Could be a bad octopus. <laughs> it could be an octopus. It is. It, it is. is an octopus. <laughs> That's what I was no, counting. I was, I was counting. I was like, all right, one, two, three, four, five. Right. 
<laughs> I was going. <laughs> yeah, but that's why I said I was I was Tentacles, driving my yeah. eyes closed. Okay, so an an octopus in Afrikaans is called a sea cat, which means ocean cat. Yeah. Mm. Well done. Okay, next up, ghost breath. Ghost what? Ghost breath. Oh, ghost, ghost breath. breath. Okay. All right. I don't know. <laughs> what type of food that is? I'm just thinking of like, what? Where can you? All right. Oh, it's at well, least okay, with I'll the give octopus. You a hint. It kind of looks like ghost breath, but not scary. Oh. It has ghosts in its name. How is that not scary? <laughs> I think I think the purpose of the name is a little bit mm. off putting. How it's much misleading. can we help him? How how much can we help him? Does I he don't get, know. You, like, how much ghost he... breath? Let, let's ghost see. Breath. Let's have Daniel guess first, and then you guys can help him. Okay. All right. Ghost breath. Let's see. Should I give you another yeah. hint? No. The wait. Wait. The wait, weather. I'll... No, not yet, not yet, not yet. No? Ghost No breath. good hint? Bad hint? <laughs> Bad hint? Okay, no, I'll, like give you, I'll give you another breath. hint. It's, oh, wait, 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 wait. Is, it, is it really, wait, wait, pepper? Is it pepper? No. No, no ghost no. breath. Oh. It's sweet. Oh, it's sweet? Oh. <laughs> ghost breath. Oh, oh it's everything. <laughs> <laughs> it's sweet. yeah you, you have sour okay. and sweet all right okay well, we're no idea. wait sweet all right ghost breath at first i was thinking think, like mixed. ghost yeah because breath all right it has okay um is it wait uh no i can't think of anything <laughs> no, I'm, 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 oh ghost breath yeah that's also like, all right okay maybe pepper but no um since it's sweet Ooh, lollipop? No? Ah. Close. 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 Gum? Well, we already done gum, so it's not gum. Um, What's the one they give you at like the circus on the stick? I think it's that. You're right. Wait, what are you, wait, <laughs> what? What are you talking about? That was a good hint. I've never seen that in my life. Okay, wait, what's it's, that? It's something that kids love. Oh, it's sweet. <laughs> okay. No, 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 <laughs> but it's, it's like a type of candy almost. It looks like insulation that you'll put in the wall. Ooh, nice. <laughs> it looks like a cloud. Let's just make it easier. Oh. Yeah, but... <laughs> I said mist at the beginning. I, I thought it was mist. I was like, okay, this could be ghost breath mist. We have a Daniel? Yeah. Oh, my God. What does it call it? I forgot the name of it. Oh. Ow. Daniel. Okay, why is it called in Portuguese? I don't know. You're asking the wrong person. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Because I don't, right? I don't, I don't really like sweets. Wait. Um, it's uh, it's cotton candy. A cotton candy. Yeah. All right. There cotton we go. candy. Yeah. Cotton candy. Um. So in Afrikaans, it's called spook awesome because it looks like breath. I don't know why it's called spook like ghost breath. Yeah. That's that's what it's like. All right. Ghost. Candy. All right. Okay. Ghost breath. <laughs> Good. How did you figure it out? I don't understand. Greg is still Googling. How? Greg, Stop I'm cheating. Not, I'm not. <laughs> at, first, at, first, <laughs> at first, I was thinking like mist in the sky, like clouds. Yeah, and then you were like, yeah, and then you were like, it's sweet. And I was like, oh, this must be a food. What food is like a cloud or a mist that's sweet? Ah, and that's the only okay. thing I could think of was like, yeah, at the that's fair good. or whatever. They give you cotton candy sticks. <laughs> No, no. Like, I was like, this guy's a cheater. He's cheating. <laughs> it is cotton candy, okay. yeah. <laughs> okay, that was cotton candy. The next one, ground bean. Ground bean? Ground as in not not ground like in Not pieces, grinded, but, but from the ground. In, in, the, uh -huh. in ground. the ground, right? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Ground bean. <laughs> Obviously not the English name. <laughs> yeah. Um. Let's see. Ground bean. That, that's interesting. Do any idea, like off the top of your head? No, because that's a problem, right? When you say the 
well, like one type of food, that food sticks to your head, like ground bean. All right, I, okay. Bean, all right, okay. Mm. Interesting. Can't think of anything. Ground bean. No. Hey, no. I draw another picture? Hint. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right, um, it has to be sour. It has to be sour. No, it's salty. It's salty, all right. Okay, mm. Game changer. <laughs> yeah, it changed everything. Okay, let me give you another hint. Um, people usually, well, you can if you go to the shop, you can buy like a whole bag of it, and it's a snack. Snack. Mm. It's salty. It's a snack. It's not. I think of coffee. To be honest with I you, think, like I think brown I bean. No, I think I know. Salt. I think you're cheating again, Brick. <laughs> <laughs> I've got access to the cloud right here. <laughs> okay, just just anything. Take a wild guess, Daniel. <sighs> it's salty. Wait, is it? This is like um. This is a, not a dish, right? It's it's. No, it's a snack. It's a you can uh, you snack. can add it to dishes or meals. When you okay, cook. ground bean. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking of coffee. I can't think of anything else. <laughs> Not that Maybe kind of bean. No, like you eat. Yeah. Eat it. Salty though. Yeah. Okay. Any guesses, Nana? What do you think? No. Greg. I'm gonna. I'm gonna guess peanuts. Yeah. No. You are definitely cheating. <gasps> Did I get it? Is it? <laughs> Is it, is it oh peanuts? my god, because it says oh, salty. Yeah, it Where is the salty? Oh, I, was like, salty. I was thinking, I was like, these aren't salty. You have to add the salt to them. So that's what that's you know, that I'm sorry, when, when we buy them here in the shop, they're already ah, salty. Ah, there you go. Yeah, that's what we oh, mean. In Brazil, it's a, to them. Yeah, oh, it, that's what you guys, yeah, you guys don't have salt? No, no, they, they have salted or unsalted. But here in yeah, Indonesia, they're mainly, yeah. they're mainly unsalted. Okay, okay. Sorry. If you said it was thing. rich in fat, I was going to guess it. Yes. But the thing is, <laughs> well, in Brazil... Well, that could also be a pizza. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> well, well, here in Brazil, one of my that's one of my favorite... One of my mom's favorite uh, uh, sweets because they cover it in chocolate. It's the same thing. Oh, nice. Like, that's why when you say, Yeah, it's not, it's not salty. It's like... Okay, the, sorry. <laughs> my bad. That was a, um, okay, uh, so, okay, so in Afrikaans... Um, a peanut is called a grondboinkie, which literally means ground bean. Okay. Okay, next up, number nine. Oh, we're getting close to the end, guys. Oh, number sorry, nine, nine is mm -hmm. a flower coal. A flower coal? Flower coal. See, that's the thing. I think of like broccoli, cauliflower, you know, you say. Flower coal. Is flower in... coal. Black that's coal. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe the, the first thing that you think of could be right, or it could be something completely different. <laughs> Those are the only two options. Wow. <laughs> well, it could be right, it could be wrong. Is there another thing that's. Flower coal. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Bray. Flower is there an in-between, right or wrong? Is it like a half, half point? <laughs> Flower, oh, yeah. I don't know. What do you think? Flower is, coal. Is there any food that kind of looks like a flower or resembles a flower? Flower? <laughs> flower I don't know. People eat flower. I don't know. Nana, any guesses? Flower coal. Yeah, I'd probably say broccoli or cauliflower. Yeah, when you say that's, that's a problem, right? You, you, you have the... That that the, the thing the word is stuck in your head. Yeah. The word <laughs> it sticks to it. Yeah, like I can't think of anything else. Okay, well, <clears throat> your uh, Daniel, your second guess was correct. Cauliflower. Is it broccoli? Mm. No, cauliflower. cauliflower. Oh, um, cauliflower. Yeah. Nice. So the Afrikaans word is blomkool, which means flower coal. Oh, um, why coal? How does coal get involved I'm with cauliflower? Sure. Probably because it looks like not. a lump. I don't know. Maybe, yeah. Oh, yeah. Language, lump. not sure. Lump. 
<laughs> flower okay. love. <laughs> the last one. Flower, flower love. Change your the language, last one please. Is the hardest, and you are I... never, ever going to get this. Okay. Oh, man. Let's do this then. So I'm going to stretch this out as long as possible. Okay. An apple lovey. Apple lovey. lovey. Apple lovey. I have no idea where this man comes from. But <laughs> Google, bro. It is not an apple. <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst part. <laughs> Hey, let's put a name mm. that's not even related to that. All right. Okay, cool. Okay, it's not. It's a kind of fruit. But that's well, it is a fruit. Yeah. More apple lovey. It's actually apple a lovey. fruit that a lot of um, people don't even know exist, to be honest. What's the Afrikaans word, Marie? <laughs> apple leafy. <laughs> oh, thank you. That was. No, you, you can't. That changed your everything. Mom, oh, yeah, I know. I know that one. I know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, apple you said leafy. apple and then you said apple again. It changed everything. Oh my, thank you so much, Mary. Okay, oh it's my, this that's... size. And Not that many people know. <clears throat> All right. Yellow. That exists. It's yellow. 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 Does it have like a funny shape to it? No, it's round. It's oh. round. It's a okay, round now yellow it's room. A kind of, it's a kind of berry. Yeah, I know exactly what it is, but I can't remember the name of it. It said... Wait, no, how useless not is to... that? Um, no. I'm it's probably something that I don't know. Yeah, I don't think we have that here. Okay. The English name is a gooseberry. Yeah, I was never going to guess that. I, really? I think they have, don't they have, they call gooseberries something else as well, I think. They have another name. Mm, well, here in South Africa, we just call them gooseberries in English, and then the African is upper leafy. Oh. Gooseberry. <laughs> Gooseberry. I've never heard of that before. Gooseberry. <laughs> okay, uh, Nana's googling it right it. now. She's like, what? Yeah, I, I, I've never heard of that before. Okay, well, I actually what missed one. This? I missed one. Well, wait, yeah, yeah, I was. There's one more. Okay, All right. here we go. The last one, official last one. An earth apple. An earth apple. <laughs> It's another fruit that has nothing to do with Makes apples. Makes no Great. sense. Yes, there is not even a hint of apple in that thing. No. Oh All right, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna say. I, I just. I just Google gooseberries, and they look like grapes. Yeah. So I'm just gonna go with grapes. Grapes. <laughs> uh, no. no. Absolutely. It, is... it has to grow out the ground, maybe. Yes. Yeah. Well, earth apple. Is that watermelon? Please don't say it's no. watermelon. That's why it's, no, no, that's no. Why it I grows. Said okay, another hint. It grows under the ground. Under the and, ground. and it's a fruit. Po potato. Not a fruit. I just said oh, potato. Oh, potato. Oh, potato. Oh. Is that potato? Is that potato? <laughs> it's a potato. Is that potato? <laughs> Daniel, well done. Okay, so an earth apple. Why did you say apple? Is an art apple or art apple? And it translates to Earth Apple. All right, yeah. I'm just gonna say this. Apple I'm just gonna say this once. Uh, people from Africa, fix your language, please. Uh, <laughs> whoa! whoa. <laughs> you say it doesn't make any sense to me. Big statements. All right, okay. Being made Big from statements Brazil. today. Wait, okay. Wait until it's... we do Portuguese. And yeah. then oh my god, you guys! Yeah. All right, yeah. to, to start off, gooseberry. We don't even grow gooseberry in Brazil, so. I, and even the states, I've never seen that before. It it actually uh, originates from the Americas, by the way. Goose it says it. uva, which means it's grape. Uh, well, ribes grape crispa, but it, I've never seen this before. Okay. Someone is eating well, it. Well, you learned something. You did. Yeah, I learned. You learned there is a fruit something. out there that you know <laughs> I'm never gonna taste it. <laughs> it's good though. I actually in my previous house we had a gooseberry bush. Okay. Yeah. So very yummy. Gooseberries. I've never had gooseberries. You know, I'm never never in the shop, Mama. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna visit. I'm gonna visit. Okay, so break if just Nana, who is South African, needed to Google that, then of course <laughs> I I have no 
chins of I guessing it. So okay. I'm no, I'm just saying, I, like, how am I gonna guess it? <laughs> okay, well, you did, you did really, you did really good. Let's see how many you got. Um, four or five. You got right? popcorn. You got lettuce, gum, a hot dog. Nana helped with that one. You got potato, which is five. Potato, yeah. Um, gooseberries and cauliflower and cauliflower. All right, so okay. that's not bad. That's Six very out of interesting. Yeah. Look at you. Yeah, good. I was never gonna, thank you. I was <laughs> never gonna guess. Well, cotton candy, I it's I had to go translate uh, cotton candy, and it's cotton candy in Brazil in Portuguese. No as well. way, <laughs> yeah, it is cotton candy. What is that, Greg? Have you ever seen one of these before? No. no. These are amazing. What is it? It's a fruit. It's a fruit. Yeah, the... Open it. And it's a bit like a light cheese. Is that, what is Oh, that? okay. But it, like, what, what's the, what's the name of it? Is it a kind of light cheese? Yeah, it's like, it's really sweet. Oh. And kind of like creamy almost. Sweet and I've never, what is it called? And they're so yummy. Mangosteen. No. Mangosteen. Mangosteen. Now hey, we all learn something new. Yeah, see? <laughs> There's so many weird fruits in this country, but they're great. They have nice. a snake fruit. Snake fruit, have you seen that? It's like, no. got the <laughs> yeah, no. it's got the skin of a snake, basically. And inside? Oh. <laughs> inside is like harder. Not hard, sorry, not like it's a more firm fruit. Oh. No, like, but it's still sweet, but it's not like, not sweet. Well, like it's it's like it. super sweet. Okay, cool. Um, so let's, let's decide what language we want to do next time. Because I thought this was a lot of fun. I liked it. <laughs> and I don't mind being the contestant next time if there's a language that you guys want to do. So what do you think? I think we should do Zulu or Portuguese. Whoa. Well, we could, oh. or we can do Mandarin. I think Mandarin has a lot of like weird translations. Oh, I love, I, oh my God. Oh, Mandarin would be okay, so cool. Okay, but you speak cool. a bit of Mandarin. Yeah. So, yeah, so I do, but uh, that's what I'm saying. Other. It's very, it, I love it because it's one of those languages that you put like, for example, ice water becomes, I, uh, you know, like cold water becomes ice. So yeah. that's, that's how they speak the language. So that's, very interesting that's it's yeah, very or straightforward. i don't know maybe yeah. maybe yeah. french or spanish um because the literal translation is a lot different than the actual mm -hmm. word in spanish so or yeah. in french or Portuguese. yeah that's true um maybe we should do portuguese let's do it okay so let's do it daniel then i want you to think about a topic so we already did food you can do mm -hmm. something like animals or even travel, cool. something mm -hmm. like that with weird translations. Um, yeah. And then we'll do I'll, this I'll again research. some Sunday. I'm not sure when, maybe next month, if you guys are keen. Yeah. <laughs> Very cool. Okay. Oh, yeah. um, I had fun. <laughs> huh? I had fun guessing things yeah, that didn't make any it was sense. A lot of fun. All right. Thank well, you so okay. much, guys, for your time and um, the people leafy. watching. Apple. Um, we, the teachers of Fluentella, would love to meet you guys. If you want to have a free lesson, completely free, obligation free, if you just want to have a chat to us and learn a new language, please sign up for a free lesson. Um, Greg teaches English, Nana also teaches, well, all of us teach English, actually. Um, and then Nana teaches Isi Zulu, Daniel Portuguese, and then we have a load of other languages as well. Um, so today was just so you guys can see our beautiful faces. Well, Brick isn't that beautiful, but you know. <laughs> Very handsome man. <laughs> um, please share this with your friends. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. And that's it. Thank you very much, teachers. I appreciate your time. Thank you. And have cool. a good weekend, everybody. Thank Thanks. you. See yeah. you next time. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye-bye. See you. See you bye -bye. next time. Bye.